Hello everyone, I'm Ashton Higgs. Welcome back to my channel. But if you're new, welcome to my channel today. In this video, I am going to be telling you guys this story about the time when I bought an expensive iPhone case. What? Like, what? I know, I got a expensive iPhone case yesterday when I was out shopping with my friend. And my stuff too. So, iPhone cases has been like almost part of my life for a very, very long time. I think ever since middle school, I have been like obsessed with it. Like, I remember when I was in middle school, I had like at least eight or ten iPhone cases in my collection. Because during middle school, when I was um, in like seventh, eighth grade, I had the um, iPhone 4, I believe. I think I had the 4, but actually in seventh grade, I had the 4 during um, eighth grade. And in my freshman year, I had the 5. And in my, under um, my sophomore year, wait, in my summer year and junior year, I had the six. But now, um, well actually, um, I had the 6S for two years during my summer junior year, but now in my senior year, I have the A+. So that's what I had. So I had the 4, yes, the 4. I had the 5S, I had the 6S, and now I have the A+. Hey, Hi. So that's all the phones I had in the past and like my generation thing. <laughs> so that's all I'm gonna be doing today. I'm not gonna talk about where I got it from and what it looks like and all that stuff. So before I even get started, <coughs> make sure that you go down below right now and subscribe if you're new. Turn on post notifications. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and comment down below. So I hope you enjoyed the video and without further ado, let's just go ahead and just jump right into this video. So it was yesterday, um, I was out with my friend Lauren, wait, yeah, shout out to you Lauren. Um, Anyways, um, I was with her yesterday and then I, um, while well, we were shopping for uh, some cases, like, you know that stand that has, like, all these cool Apple cases that you don't really see in the store that, that, that often, like, if you go to the, if you go to the Galleria, like, if you all live in New York and you go to, any, and you go to, to the Galleria or Westchester Mall or the Thousand Mall, you all know what I'm talking about. So, we went to the city center, I'm not sure where the city center was, but, um, it's like a mall, it's just mall mall, like, you all know where Toys R Us was? That's what I'm talking about. Anyways, so, um, we were just, like, shopping, just, like, walking around until the, um, we were, we were there because we wanted to see a movie called The Star Is Born. And we didn't see it because the seats were, were ridiculous. We wanted to sit together, like, the two of us, we wanted to sit with each other, but actually we um end up like the seats that we had to sit apart but we didn't want that so that's why we couldn't um see the movie but um my our backup plan was to go to starbucks instead and just hang out over there and just like shop and we thought we wanted to go to bad guys but we thought it was a long way so we didn't want to go there anyways um before we went to see if the movie was available um, during that time. We wanted to shop for some cases, and nobody was there when we um there. My friend liked this Game Boy phone case, like you know that Game Boy phone case that can be that can be that can be functional, like can be fully like you know what I mean. So <coughs> yeah, um, that's the case that she liked, and I liked a lot of cases, guys. I spent like almost an hour trying to find a case that I like on my phone. Like, literally like... What in the world? So... Yeah. Then after that, um... 
while we were waiting for somebody, we were stopping by the movies, like, like, like I just said, but then rather we exit the movie theater, um, I said to my friend, well, the well, well, thing that I want to know if someone was, if someone is at the stand, and then she was like, oh yeah, I think I saw someone. Wait, someone? Someone. So, um, sorry about the terrible lighting, but anyways, we just saw somebody over there. So while we were there, um, someone was, someone was there. Awesome. <laughs> but then, we were shopping for the case, and my friend was like, oh, I have to get that Game Boy case. Like, if you all are, are from, like, the 90s or, like, whatever Game Boy is about, what meant did you all know what I'm talking about? I had Game Boy when I was younger. <laughs> yeah, I liked it, but then I dropped it in the toilet. <laughs> it didn't eat a cube, which is awesome. Cause if it was electrocuted, then I'm not sure what I would do. Cause I was young, like I was little. I was probably like I don't know, two or five years old when it came when I had it. I don't even know. Um. Then right after she got her case, I was shopping for mine, and there was this case that she liked, and there's another the one that I liked. And she was like, "Oh, I have one with, with the flowers and the whatever." But I like this case that has that is like silver, which I didn't know it was transparent. If you're like me, I love transparent case. I don't care. Well, actually, I like transparent case, but I definitely like the pattern case. But I like both. But I mostly like the transparent cases with design on it, like you know. So it took me a while to figure out which case that I would like because I had the um, the A plus. And they look like they are for an A plus, and it's ironic because <coughs> I'm dying. Um, it's so ironic that they didn't have a case for a Samsung. I'm like, okay, wow, that's ironic. I didn't know that they had cases for the for only the iPhones. Like they have a case for the iPhone X. Um, yeah, and or the iPhone X S Max or whatever, they only had cases for the iPhones. I feel bad for the, for the people who have Samsungs and Androids out there. <laughs> I feel bad. Um, it took me a while to find but then I found one that I really like. But I was like, hey, I want to just get all three. Like, I feel like getting all three. I feel like getting that one, that one, and that one. And then, um, and then my friend, um, she said. I don't think you should do that because they're kind of expensive. And then I said, oh, how much did yours cost? And then she said, $25. Like, and, and then I was like, wait, what? $25 for a K-Dog? That is, that is really expensive. Like, what? Like, excuse me? <laughs> like, $25 for a freaking iPhone case. Like, really? I thought they were 5 bucks or 2 bucks or 3 bucks. Like, $25 for an iPhone case. You have a guy be kidding me to the highest level of guy be kidding me. Huh? My mom said that. So it was kind of everything was priced. Like all the cases that were there, they look expensive, but they look um like there are ten dollars or fifty dollars, but they're actually twenty five dollars, thirty five dollars or whatever. And this, yeah, oh my god. So then, after looking and looking, um. I was like, you know what? I'm not. I'm not getting all three. I'm just gonna get just one because I think it'll be very expensive. So like, if I have like almost everything, like if it like three iPhone cases would cost actually fifty or forty bucks. I'm like, oh my god, that is so expensive. Like I didn't know they were ex like expensive. So then I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna get that one, which I'll show you all in a minute. So um. This case that I really liked, um, I didn't know it was transparent, but I'm sure it will look like right now. Alright guys, so this is what it looks like. This is what the case looks like. Um, it's a really cool transparent, it's like conveyance side, it's a protective case. And it looks kind of, it looks kind of expensive because like the design and the camera hole. And... The um the the volume the, the volume button and the power button they look different. Like I thought they were transparent, but they're actually a different color. 
So, oh, and also, um, there I was supposed to put a bumper thing on this bone, so that way it can actually stay protective. And the only, well, the only question that I have is, how do you take this off? <laughs> like, how do you take this thing off? Like, I've been like trying to take it off with, with my hand. I'm trying to like push the bottom of the case. Like, it's not coming off. Like, what the heck? It's not coming off. So, um, I'm gonna give you all a little close and a little closer look up on my phone. But let's just say that this was pretty expensive. And I know what I'm about to say the price of the phone is ridiculously expensive. This thing costed $27. $27 for an iPhone case. You gotta be kidding me. Like, it's like it's expensive. It's almost like $30. Like, what the It didn't only wait, but I have to say it. So, technically, I spent $27 on a case that I didn't know it was expensive. And it made my phone like insanely heavy. Well, the weight makes it more heavier, but I'm gonna show you all what it looks like. All right, guys. So this is the phone. This is what this is what it looks like. Um, it is it's really pretty color. Um, I must say it's a really pretty color. Um, as you can see, it still says iPhone over here, <laughs> and the camera hole. That's what I'm talking about. And it's really pretty, goes well with my phone. And the volume button, they look incredibly different. Like, um, is like silver or something. And the power button, same thing. And as you can see, um, I'm not sure if you guys can see it, but they have this bumper thing on it so that way it can actually be protective or something. And you see that thing. It looks like a hard case, but I'm not sure what the heck it is. But, um, yeah, that's the case up close. All right, everyone. Thank you all so much for watching. If you all haven't, if you all haven't seen my previous video, see it until the end. Subscribe if you're not. And also, I'm going to show you guys my costume from, from, from Halloween. And I never got a chance to um, film a video on, on Halloween because, like, I was busy and I was hanging out with my boyfriend on Halloween. Yes, guys, I hung out with, with my guy friend on Halloween because I haven't seen them since that day. Well, the last time that I, that I hung out with him was on Halloween. And the other day that I hung out with him was he went to the homecoming game together at the school that he graduated from and the school that I'm currently in. So basically, he graduated my school, but I have one more year left until I'm done. So, thank you for watching. I love you all very much. Have a great day. And let's try to get you up to 100 subscribers. Please get to my goal, guys. And my guys, I'm wearing pajamas. Well, PJ Bottoms, as you can tell. Because it's pretty chilly out here. If you all live in New York, you all will, you all will understand. And I wish I was still in LA because I heard it still be... 87 80 or 70 degrees outside like really 80 and 70 degrees during the fall wait until it's winter let's see how the weather looks <laughs> well anyway i'm gonna end it i'm gonna end it right here and i'll see you all in my next video so yeah peace out guys bye